I just feel like this place is so interesting, like every corner you turn there's like a story being told, things happening, people doing things and going places, like it's just so vibrant, I love it. At the airport again, in Chicago. It is raining a lot here, but Chicago it has been really cool and really good. I've enjoyed it here and I'm sad to be leaving and welcome back. Made it onto the plane, albeit quite late. It's an hour and a half late now. Some technical issues, I don't like the sound of that. Maybe they're missing a flange. Good to be back. It is really good to be back here. I love it. New York City. So I guess we're back in New York City. And this time for the first ever time that I've been here, we're staying in Manhattan. I have never stayed in Manhattan, ever. I've always stayed in Brooklyn. And now we're in Manhattan. It feels like a whole different experience. Let's go and check out the view. There's a street that we just came in from downstairs, the hotel. What have we got up here? Oh! Whoa! That's the Empire State Building! I had no idea the Empire State Building was right next to where we're staying. That's, that's, that's cool, look at that! There's a great view of it as well! Nice! We are going to get some dinner now. Take our first steps out of the hotel. Check the neighbourhood. Right by the, what do you call it? Empire State. Look at that. Right outside the place we're staying is like right in New York. So many people here. It's electrifying, honestly. I felt kind of excited all day about arriving here. Like, I don't know. We went to really nice places on this trip, right? Here more than anywhere, I felt excited to be, to come back here and arrive here. And as soon as you step in the city, you feel energized and electrified. It's really, it's really awesome. And you guys know who've been watching my channel for a long time that I love it here in New York. But it really is, it's, it's just a feeling about here. It's, it just feels great. Honestly, and I know that New York is not everyone's cup of tea, all these people, lots of people have said that to me on my channel, but I just absolutely love it. I love it and I love being here. It just feels, it feels good. But I do fancy if we can get into it, there's a Chinese place over there. I think it'd be nice. This place is quite fancy. So they don't do like sweet and sour sauce here. <laughs> Or Wrong crackers. crackers. <laughs> I'm not even sure if I can eat these properly with these sticks. Top dish. It's nice though. Wow. You're gonna love that. Chicken, noodles, beef. Oh, that was a good dinner at the China Cafe. Well, Cafe China. It was really good. A bit spicy for normal Chinese food standards, I would say. But anyway, listen. We're back out onto the streets of New York. Where are we going? Times Square. Times Square. <laughs> it's just right here. Might as well then. It's night time. Night time in Times Square. I just feel like this place is so interesting. Like every corner you turn, there's like a story being told. Things happening. People doing things and going places. Like it's just so vibrant. I love it. So much noise like, all around us and sounds and smells. New York is an assault on all the senses. And I like it, I like being assaulted by New York. Wow, when you get close to Times Square, it really is unmistakable. My face is going all different kinds of colors right now, look at that. Blue, green, yellow. 
Ah, uh, London's not like this at 10 o'clock at night. Whoa. Never in a million years. Honestly, it's 10 to 10 p.m. right now. There is never a single moment in London at this time of night at 10 p.m. that it's like this. Never. That's crazy. So many people, look at that. Open top bus tour here at 10 o'clock at night. You can't do that in London. And it's full. <laughs> it's actually full. Oh, you are. just found a tiny little corner here where there's like, I don't know, five meter square of pavement that's free for us. This is this is like insane. I mean, there's really no reason for us to come to Times Square other than mind <laughs> numbing tourism, mind numbing bad tourism. But it's our first night in New York in such a long time we thought we'll come. That was the first time, the, the first time. place we came, the first time we were here in New York as well. Here, yeah. And I think it was kind of like the same. We just arrived and we were like, what do we do? Let's go to Times Square. See unless I click on there. Right? I'm not sure what else we're supposed to do now. I think uh, probably go home and go to bed. Yes. Sleep. And I want to do my nails today. It's okay? It's late and I want to do my nails. Look! This is like the sun, I've got fake rings on. <laughs> Shadow rings. <laughs> Alright, we're back in the hotel. I'm hot and sweaty. It is nice and warm out there. Uh, on the streets in New York. It feels good to be back, I feel energy, and I've said this before on my channel and on Twitter and all the rest of it before. I want to live here. I want to reaffirm that. I want to live here. I know a lot of people don't understand it, but I want to live here. I'm going to make it happen. I know the visa stuff is tough, but I will live here. At least for a little while to try it out properly. I just feel here's a place that you can make moves. Make movies. Alright, I'm going to bed. Thanks for watching guys, until the next adventure, have a good night, morning, evening, afternoon, or whatever time of day it is, wherever you are in the world. The journey continues. Mm -hmm.